Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more Europa Universalis 4 as the Mongol Kingdom. Going to be Empire soon. Uh, we cannot be a great power, even though we're stronger than mm, like five of the great powers. We are subject to Ming, even though we're the sixth great power in the world, which is kind of funny. But uh, Or I guess we'd be seventh under the Mamlux. Or yeah, I guess eighth under England, whatever. Anyways, it's been good. Uh, don't I want to bef before we get started though? I want to remind you guys to hop in the Discord uh, or check out the Twitter. It's the best way to keep up to date with the channel. And if you're enjoying the series, show your support, leave a like. I genuinely appreciate it. But uh, the last episode was a doozy. I think I think it was the last episode. We peaced out with Ming. We're still a tribute, and we gave him one province, a bunch of money. <clears throat> so right now we're just re we're just honestly recovering. Um, we can finally take tech, but I really don't want to until I can, um, embrace this institution here. And I don't want to take any more loans out, so I think what I'm gonna do is we're just gonna speed five it. Um, yeah, oh, Tangri would be nice. So let's see if we can rent out any Kandatiari. No, nobody wants it. Let's get you guys over here. We got lots of money coming in, which is really nice. Apparently Ming gets 40, 40 ducats. And we got accepted cultures. AE impact will be nice. Oh, that's a pretty good idea actually. And we got years of separatism. So we actually have minus 10 years of separatism between national traditions and this idea. 15 years of separatism. Oh, that's like no separatism then. Cool. Didn't, I didn't look at that. Um, I think we're going to hold off here for a minute. Get some tech first. So we're super behind. Actually, you know what? Never mind. We're going to spend it. Send it, spend it. Alright, let's get these armies shuffle split here. I don't care if Jun Su is upset. Uh, we could take this tech, but we're not going to because this is super expensive. So Kazan... Oh, we... Oh, wait. Tribal feud. Oh, we could take land from them. Right. Because we are, uh, we border them, technically. Transoxiana definitely needs to lose land pretty soon, but he's got a decent alliance network here from the old, uh, Timmers, Timurids. So let's, we're not going to pay off the loan. I'm thinking we're probably going to accept tech and we're going to actually do it via one extra loan. So whenever I can do it by just taking out one extra loan, I'm going to do it. Let's actually see if anybody wants to buy any Kandatiari. So, my rival doesn't want to. You don't want to because you're running a deficit. You are not at war. Balmanis is not at war. So, <clears throat> here's a here's a little tip. If you're trying to get... Um, let me see here. You need to find somebody who doesn't hate you. Everybody hates me because I've taken land from them because I'm a horde. Sorry, I guess I should probably just since I'm in peacetime. I should just worry about uh, getting these Steps over here kind of consolidated so <clears throat> Let me see here my loans are looking like 300 and some change. So where are we at here? think this will do Mongolia Jansu Did they announce me as a Oh, Korea. Who announced me as a rival? Ashikaga. Oh, Very cool. Alright, so let's take that out. And then we can do that. And we can get that click twice. And then we can get this click twice. Oh no! It's close. Bummer. Um, so that gives us a miltech advantage about around everybody. Oh, you're at as an 8. Jeez. Let's, uh, let's annex you. You're gonna be pretty worthless. So it's gonna take me 9 years. worthless anyways let's um is there really nobody who wants so what about bengal would you want some kandatiari he would yeah sounds good man i'm happy to help out i'm not gonna get i'm not actually gonna actually i'm not actually gonna send you anybody but it's glad i'm glad that you could take them I sold him my cheaper one which hopefully it doesn't end up being an issue so japan is consolidated You are going to get war decked. 
Uh, somehow I have a coalition again. Okay. <laughs> Who else is going to join it? Nobody. Just C Sang or Sang or whatever. Who I think I may be able to war deck now. Very good. And Assam will help them, but I don't care. I will send you guys down here. Time to consolidate all my lands, right? So let's, uh, it is show superiority. So let's just come up here and kill some, um, some of these dudes. Let's get you guys over here, actually. Uh, Fudali. Stack white, possibly? Yeah, very nice. I like it. And we will get over here on your capital, and then we will just send a bunch of random stacks, little stacks everywhere, to siege you down. Looks like he may have sent people to uh, colonize this, which is cool. So I have to revoke that on the 5th of June. Very good. So we are going to take all your land and all your money. Very good. We are going to raise this all. Can't raise much of it because there's not much there to raise. Capital is a 31 dev province. Very nice. See, I said there's not much to raise and then all of a sudden this is what happens. So let's get you guys over there, get you guys over here. Um, when do we cancel our Condottiaria agreement? June. Uh, so let's get you guys over here. Siege down Sang. I need to get more cannons in the army as well. Do I finish this up or do I take this? I think I just wait on the idea. Very good. Are we going to have any rebels here at all? Nope. We're good. All right, what about you? So you're allied to Chan Su, who's in a coalition with me. Against me, so this would be a nice excuse to uh, full annex John Su, and I will do just that. And I will pour up all that. I can't believe that's a hundred dev province. That's crazy. Or I mean, not a hundred dev. A uh, thirty dev province over there. Oh, cool. And we get some uh, extra tactics. So I think, see, like ideally, this would be the time that I would be able to finally get that war with Ming, right? But it's fine. It is what it is. So Ajam is getting beat up by Sadia. Very cool. And I am eating up him. So he canceled. He canceled on me. I hope that doesn't mean that I lost trust. Maybe it's, oh yeah, I'm not sure. So let's get you guys down here and uh, I guess we'll Put that guy there. Do some looting. Okay, sounds like we uh, just need to get down here. Ajam is not gonna want to do much by the looks of it. So if I could get down here on their capital, I would like to. No, it doesn't look like that's gonna happen either. So let's uh, siege back our land. take mill points that's fine I guess this is siege down let's get over here get you guys over there I don't think I'll be able to full annex Jansu but I can definitely make some damage to their economy as well as uh, like take money from them which is gonna be really nice these guys are gonna peace out soon as soon as these rebels or as soon as this guy pieces out down here So, Assam, oh, I can't take money from him. Bummer. Hopefully he pieces out soon. I would like to take all his money, right? Very good. Oh, wait. What? Jeez, oh, Pete. No wonder you're getting your teeth kicked in. John, get out of my land, asshole. Let's uh, finish sieging down all this stuff. Uh, idea cost. Cool. Thank you. 
mill points to Ming because of reasons. All right, let's just siege all this down. Let us take that. And we get the aggressive extent, AE impact reduction lowered, so that's really good. Come over here. Might actually be able to separate piece out John Zhu for full annex. No, we cannot. Okay, well, that's fine. So in that case, well, I am going to separate piece them out. Um, do they have any provinces worth taking? Actually, kind of all of these ones. So let's do this. Uh, take that one, and then you will give me all your money. That's uh, a lot of AE, but I don't care a whole lot. And then we raise all this. Do we take any more of this? Nope. We just took these three. Very good. Core all that up. And then we take you. And we take all your money. And we can't raise it because it was three dev. <laughs> Very good. All right, cool. So... That war is over, and uh, this war will be over momentarily. It's occupied by another war. So I just have to let the all this occupation happen, apparently. I suppose I can piece him out right now. I just would prefer to connect up my lands, you know, but that's fine. And then we can pay off a loan and turn off the army. And just like that, we're good. All right, I need to... Uh, Raise this again, because I can do that, apparently. 14 dev. I'll take it. And uh, get rid of some uh, overextension. Let's uh, wait a couple months, get rid of this big 9-bit. Nine, nine okay, so apparently we have some, uh, some rebel issues going on. One more month. Very good. All these like random one stacks of rebels. And our rebel factions are just like literally it's it's literally nothing. So this is honestly perfect for us. Step riders. Let's see if anybody else wants to uh take Kandatiari from us. Let's see here. Current wars. So Japan is at war with Hosokawa. But I don't think I could rent to him because I don't have land. And he has a deficit. So you are at war. Do you want some uh, some men in your army? No. I wonder why not. Oh, they're my rival? Lan Zhang is my rival? Jeez. Okay. Anybody down here at a war? You guys at war? War? Huh? Anybody? Ooh. Muscovy has deficits. Hello? Commonwealth Eastern Europe? African Dottieri? No access, land access to capital. Well, I can certainly change that. Doesn't look like they want to give me any money though anyways. Would dismiss troops? I'm very confused. Okay, so... Uh, admin, yes, please. I want to finish up this group, this idea group. So countries wish to hire Kandantiari, but you can't afford it. Don't trust you would participate, right? Okay, so I did actually get some mal effects from when I was renting before. Let's get some maintenance up so we can fight these rebels. Oh. And then turn maintenance back down. Not all the way down, because we still want to reinforce our armies. We still have a couple hundred men that need to reinforce. Um, we're just still recovering. We still haven't paid off hardly any of our loans, so it's uh, it's been a tough one. Yearly inflation reduction would be nice. And we're just speed five in it, trying to uh, get through this tough time economically. I mean, we've expanded a bit too, so I'm not too upset. We're definitely making progress. It's just about pulling that trigger and getting Ming to explode. But it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to do it with the mandate where it's at. So I think I'm just going to have to expand and expand until I can uh, raise the army that I think would be adequate, right? 
So why does Japan want to be my rival? <clears throat> Japanese Korea, huh? I mean, I could easily beat up on them, I think. Let's see what kind of army they're fronting right now. Okay, whatever. Apparently, they're not going to show up here, so let's go Japan. Oh, I could easily kick them. I could take all this land from Korea for them, from them. Huh. <coughs> oh, right. I need to core up that land. <laughs> My B. I'm sure that was probably bugging the crap out of some people. Root out corruption, because for some reason I have 38... Why? Unbalanced research. Really? It's that bad? Oh, that's a stupid modifier. Goodness gracious. Okay, well, I guess we, uh... We're gaining corruption for a little bit then. Let's turn off our forts. Oh my goodness. Okay. This is stupid. <laughs> this is very stupid. Whatever. I guess uh, after we get rid of our overextension, that'll help. Too many territories is something we could probably fit remedy right now. North Illin Hills. So let's uh, state that up. That'll help with a little bit of it. We have rebels in uh, where? This, this province down here. Okay, I guess. I really don't want to lose the ducats, so I would prefer not to. <clears throat> but he's not... Okay, yeah. Nope. Not gonna happen. I have to, because he's not gonna send any men to do it. So let's get you guys marched around here. All the way around this wasteland. Um, very good. Get you guys over here. Okay, I don't care. We have to accept this. This series has ended up being a bit tougher than I kind of expected it to. So, he went down here. But I don't think he, I think he's probably coming back, right? So, let's uh, root out that corruption, just so we're not losing all that men, or all that. Okay, whatever, screw it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna root it out and wait for these rebels to come back. Are you going to attack me? Um, do I care about the army tradition? No. Because we have not had literally any luck with that, so... Okay, and we're also going to turn off our armies. Because reasons. Um, let's keep that income positive and just get you guys over here. If the rebels come back, we'll go put them down, but... Oh, they're dead. We're good. Alright, let's see how much unbalanced research this gets rid of. None. It didn't It didn't change it. Oh, okay. Well, if that's the case... <laughs> I guess we just speed 5 it until we get tech. No more mill tech because unbalanced research apparently crashes your corruption. That's crazy. I didn't realize it was so strong. Uh, let's continue to root it. <clears throat> More corruption. Yeah, I'm gonna pass. Uh, we shall be one nation. Very good. Yeah, take all my points, please. Royal marriage from Oirit. Very good. Let's actually divert trade from you guys. <clears throat> See if I can get a little extra cash. How's our trade looking anyways? Probably... Nah, no more, no more gold provinces. So all of these are capable of getting gold? Is that what that says? Ah, very cool. I guess I never knew that. Oh, that's how that, that button worked. Land maintenance modifier might be a good one, but I guess if I have my army turned off, it wouldn't save me a whole lot. Trade efficiency, but yeah. All right, well. I guess that'll do it for this episode. Hope you guys are enjoying the series. If you are, please show your support. Leave a like. It really helps me out and helps other people find the videos. If you want to see more of this, you can subscribe. And uh, make sure you check out the Discord. Great conversations to be had over there. Appreciating it. And look forward to seeing you there. Cool. Well, with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later.